Hi everybody, it's Michelle with Comfy Cozy Living. Yesterday I had one heck of a sourcing day. <laughs> um, and today has been already a long day. I, I was so exhausted from yesterday that I slept really long, really long. Like I passed out last night during Miss Pamela's live sale. I just couldn't anymore. I was so exhausted. And then today I slept really late. So it is 5 p.m. now and I just think I got that old computer set up. I had to go to Goodwill and get a good, get a proper, I guess, keyboard for it. It took me forever to get this all lined up. And I still have to figure out how to get internet and all that stuff on there. I haven't used an actual computer in, well, I used it at the library, you know, for basic stuff. But, like, actually to remember all this stuff, it's been just over two years since I had my job. But we had an IT guy, you know what I mean? <laughs> and he liked, you know, he was, had him, you know. And so, um, like, if I needed something, he didn't make me feel stupid. He was, like, 25 years old. So, anyhow, let me just, huh, this might be a long haul, but I'm going to have to, like, I'm doing the first Goodwill we went to. And I'm just going to do it all in one haul because I have so much stuff from this yesterday that I can't break it up too much. Because I need you to see it before I sell it. And I need to... <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. So, I got this for me. It's a 31 crossbody bag. Um, if you guys have been watching me for a certain amount of time, you know I love me some 31. I've talked about it. Um, and this is... This is like new. This bag is like new. Oh, and they got a dime in the little pocket or in the bag, uh, thing. That's awesome. <laughs> I mean, the, the whole thing is... Oh, somebody's got a receipt in here for uh, $43.19 from... I don't know where. Why do I care? I don't know. Just fun. But anyhow, it's like brand new. It's awesome. And I love it. Then I got this. I am not even sure if this is the right thing or not, but I just, first of all, the box, I, I got my attention. But I, this is these black crayon thingies for artists, and that's going to um, Alex's daughter. Um, then I got these um, Pimpernel um, coasters. I don't know. They're no, they're no big deal, but they were half off. So, um, I mean, they're pretty, you know. One um, is the North. They're all North American wildflowers, but they're all different. Um, so they're and they're all brand new, perfect condition. So I thought, you know, I know like a lot of people like flowers. And, I mean, maybe I'd even sell, save these for spring. I'm not sure. Um, this, I think, is amazing. It is, like, brand new. It's this, um, gosh, I guess you could go with either side. It is gorgeous. <laughs> Excuse me. It's, um, a oh, beautiful scarf. It's so soft. I feel like this would be good for a scarf, but you know how I, I what I'm putting it out as is an awesome like table runner. So um it's gonna be up to you. But look at how pretty look how pretty that is. Isn't it? Ah oh, Love it. Love it. <laughs> Oh, I got some shirts for my little uh, Cheeto Chili Cheese Fry. That's uh, Alex's son. <laughs> oh, hope he likes them. Um, then I got this. Um, I got this. Uh, I just got this book for um, some of the pages to start using for um, inserts. Because, you know, I can't. I, I don't always find awesome cards and stuff. I don't, I don't, um, do the game pieces and stuff. 
I think, you know, to each his own. Everybody's got their thing, and I don't want to totally be, you know, like everybody else. I like to do my thing. So usually I do a postcard and like a flash card or a, a thank you card and a postcard or a thank you card and a recipe card. Those are my things. But if I run out of regular cards, then I can just fold one of these in half. These pages are cool to to do, you know. So there's that. And then I got this for um, um, Bianca also. That's Ash, A Alex's art. Now, if you were on Miss Pamela's sale last night, then you heard me talking about Mr. Bobby Sherman. Now, I was a Sean Cassidy girl, Donny Osmond, Tony DeFranco, and then Rick Springfield and all. But I saw, I don't always look at the records, but I saw the Sean Cassidy Born Late album. And I was like, oh my gosh, I have that. I mean, I literally still have it. I get rid of all my albums at some point in time, but I kept my teen, my, like my childhood idol ones. Thank God I did that. I wish I had kept all of them, but you know, moving and moving and moving, that's a lot of weight. And, um... So I'm just glad I kept certain things, you know, out of my life. And um, so then I was like, oh, I wonder if, because then I saw some Bobby Sherman. And I was like, oh, I wonder if they'll have my my old Sean Cassie album with the Do Run Run. And because that one came with a poster. And I still have the album, but I don't think I have the poster. You know, I should look inside my album. I don't think I do, though. But. I looked and they did have it, but they didn't have the poster. But anyhow, I looked at some of the Bobby Sherman albums and I had to get this one. I had to. And in advance, I'm going to just tell you guys, you're welcome. Now, whether you're a Bobby Sherman fan or not, you're probably going to enjoy this. There he is, looking all dapper. But you ladies... Well, there he is again. I'll just give you a little preview. A little preview. A little preview of what I'm about to give you. Oh, yeah. There you are. There you go. Look at him in them leather pants. This is super preview preview. Mm-hmm. And, um, and then here's the album. With the, um, It has an album. With, uh, with a, a colorful album cover. Which, I mean... You know, I love that. Oh, that's awesome. Gosh, I wish I loved Bobby Sherman. Because that's awesome. I would tape that up on, or put that up on my wall. But talk about putting up on your wall. Are you ready? I mean, wait for it. <gasps> oh! Oh, yeah. Holy moly. <laughs> Oh, that's all I'm going to say. I mean, I want to say so much more. But let's just say he is the whole package. Uh, I mean, what? Okay. That's, that's, that's something right there. Mm-hmm. So, um, yeah, mm -hmm. this is some kind of album, <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah, it is. <laughs> so there you go. Well, some Bobby Sherman. And, uh, again, you're welcome. Moving right along. Let's find some other things that I got that are less, um, objectifying. <laughs> I obviously haven't had time to look up anything. Um, I have no idea anything about this. But it's pink. 
looks like depression glass possibly, but I don't really know because it almost looks too, it almost, it, it's, it's like newer of a piece. I don't know. So I have to look it up, but it's really nice. It's that bottom with that starburst. No markings on it that I, I have seen yet, but I just thought it was a pretty piece of glass. And I decided to get it. Uh, oh, my God. Oh, yeah, this. Um, it's kind of delicate. It's so sweet. Oh, it's so sweet. Little puffy, a little owl. It's like a little fur ball. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. And then it has the little feathers. And on this piece of driftwood. This is so cool. So cool. So cute. I'm, I know people are going to go freaking out over that little thing. He's a cutie. Now, a few weeks ago, I bought some baskets from the, um, from my girls at, um, my besties at Fat Bird Finds. And this is a, an exact match, um, of the style. And I haven't put them up yet, but I mean, I intend to, you know, today or tomorrow. I mean, I got so many things going on, but it's so funny because I've really been catching up on like major things. So I got to say that I'm um, pretty happy with the way things are kind of coming along. Um, so yeah, I, I, oh gosh, guys. Okay. I've been finding these. I got, now started out with these at this store and then I found some more later, but I thought I had found some at the Goodwill at my Goodwill earlier. This, I don't remember. I had to go today and run and get that, um, keyboard and I found one, but its whole head was glued together. So I didn't get it because I don't know if I have all the sets, but I, I now have like more of these than I can imagine. And I know, was it Jeffrey or somebody just had these? These are home code. Um, I'm not going to turn them all over and stuff for you because, you know, right now it's just the haul. Let's, let's, you know, be realistic here. So here's the other, here's another one. Little fairies. Or, um, sprites or what are they called? I think they're little fairies. Little garden fairies. Then these are home call also. And here's the one. And here's another one. Got a little smudge on it, but. So here's two of them. And I'm pretty sure that there's a third one in here. I, I'm pretty sure I found all three of them then. Um, of these. So, <laughs> so cute. Been finding a lot of home co, but um, hey, you know what? People like it, and it's still rather collectible. Now this is such a cutie. It, he looks like he'd be a bank, but he's not. Um, he, he's just ceramic, and look at him with his sweet little eyes. Little pumpkin, I mean little um, pilgrim bear. He doesn't have any markings. Somebody just did a nice job on him. That's all. He's super cute. Maybe I got him for free because he doesn't even have a price tag on him. I'm very lucky. I know a lot of people say if, you, if they don't have a price tag on something that their your store won't even sell it. But at mine, they usually just find, you know, they'll just... Either call up a manager or they'll just uh, give you a price. So I think I put a bunch on in one thing. I sure did. I wrapped these. So this one is, oh boy. Yeah. I'll eat something there. I, I'm not sure what kind of dog that is, but it's Mark Japan right there. 
And there's like, um, well, I guess this is a, a raccoon, which I hate, but you guys like all these critters with the weird eyes and stuff too. And he doesn't, I don't think, have a marking. I look closer, you know. Then this one is probably a baby raccoon. Hey, uh, you know how I feel about them, bud. <laughs> I am here for you guys. <laughs> and, oh, another baby. It's like a little family. I guess I'll be selling like a, a little family because there's his tail. You know, little, little, uh weird-eyed raccoon family. Then there's this one. So, this dog and this dog, they might be related because of the way the front of them is. I mean, they're like both like half white, half brown or something. But see how the front is kind of like that like saggy like skin or something? I don't know. I just had to get them all. Um, I'm just going to set those right there. And hopefully that's going to be okay. I don't think I'll knock them over. Um, got a piece of lusterware. Just pretty. Very pretty. Oh, he's just so sweet. I couldn't leave him. I did not find a little match. But look, he's a salt or pepper. He's just cute like a, a sweet little praying child at Christmas. You know. He's got the kissy lips. I got a thing about that. Got the kissy lips. So he's sweet. He's so sweet. And, um, yeah, I'm all about, like, saving those singles. If I see a single shaker, I'm going to get it. And, I mean, I think 9 out of 10 of them, if not more, um, are just cute as, like, a um, figurine, you know. Look, I'm, I'm going to tell you what. You're welcome on this. I don't know what. This is some kind of something. This is a... I know you guys love your cats. Okay, so that one's had a little... Loss of paint on the eye. But they're, like, in love. See? He and her. She and him. <laughs> she and he. Him and her. I don't know how it goes. But it's a... And I can't write. I can't. But I forgot what the song was. Because I thought it... I, th I wanted to say it was Happy Birthday, but no. It's made in Taiwan... I'll have to play it again. He does have some weird paint, like, texture. But he's fine. Look how pretty. Look how cute they are. This is a different kind of something. You know, I don't get cat things too often, but I think I brought it pretty good on that item. <laughs> Oh, this is, I got a bunch of restaurant where these, I think, were um, Buffalo China. I don't remember. Maybe not. No, Shenango. Okay, these were Shenango dishes, or bowls. Oh, and I just, um, I think I got, I think I got eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, or six. Maybe I got six. We'll see. You know, at the sale, I'll I'll be able to tell you for sure. But it appears that I got six. I thought this was super cool. I like the shape. I like the feet. I like the color. Oh, 
Oh, this is for me. And I bought some barkeepers fun, finally. This is the pattern I grew up with, and we had the bowls and the plates and just a couple other items. So this bowl, I ate cereal out of this for so much of my life. Like, I'm talking half of my life even at this point in time. I don't even know. Um, so I was 26, so almost half my life at this point. Um, so it's a little scuffed up, but 50 cents. And I said, you know what? For 50 cents, I'm getting it because I had it. I had only one and I dropped it a couple weeks, about a week ago. And it, it broke. Now, it doesn't, they don't break too much, but that one did because, you know, it, it has, does have some age to it. And, um, you know, I thought, well, I haven't tried that barkeeper spend, and I knew I was going to get some because it was on my list, finally. And I did. You can probably, you know, no, no, I was going to say, you can probably see it sitting on the counter, but no, you can't. But anyhow, I got this. So I think this is that thumbprint design on the milk glass. So nice. And just on time for Christmas, I know somebody's going to be able to put some really cute, like, Christmassy. You can put, like, a um, vintage, um, like, candle ring around this and then put a candle in there and set it in here. And you could do so many things. You know, I got ideas for days if anybody ever needs any. <laughs> oh. Then I got some more restaurant wear and this is sterling and it, it's sterling vitrified china and i think i got three pieces but these are these big platter you know like well they're like the platter shaped plates they're plates you know nice big plates i only got three there was one that had big old crack through it so i did not get that one but three really nice size plates or platters However, you want to use them. Then, let's see what this one is. Oh, yeah, I love this piece. My bestie found this. Uh, it's by Maurice. I'll show you the pet tag. Everybody always wants to see the price tag. Well, not everybody, but one person gives me a little, little bit of flack about it. So, it's a... Um, you know, it's a sick, it's an ashtray. This was giving me all the treasure craft vibes, though. It's super cool. Very cool. And uh, in case you didn't know that the um, pineapple is a sign of hospitality. I have one item left from this haul. And it is amazing. That's what I'm going to say. <sighs> this is so amazing. It's, um, crap sticks. What is it? Is it the, um, why can't my brain work? I can't think, and you guys, I can't see. It's, it's, I think it's federal, I don't know. Help me out here. But this thing is massive. This looks like an old light light shade thing. It's not so cool. This is a great bowl. This is in great condition. Look at it. Look at it. This is amazing. This is probably going to be in um, my Tuesday's uh, four away sale at Misty's channel. This is amazing. So, um, yeah, that's an, uh, I'm going to stick a little plug in there. Tuesday, October 20th at 1 p.m. Eastern, 12 noon Central, 10 a.m. Pacific at Thrifter Junker Vintage Hunter, Misty's channel. We are having a four-way sale with Misty, me, Alex from Chapter 2 Vintage Co., and Michael, Michael Todd, as you know him, who has an Instagram channel called The Cult of Vintage where he takes us on his shop with me trips Thursday mornings before my sale. And let me just tell you, he is a delight. And I know that a lot of you are like chomping at the bit to get to meet Mr. Michael. 
and see him in person, like face to face, and you will not be disappointed. He's got the best laugh in all the land, and he is an amazing human being. And I can tell you that from personal experience because I talk to him daily. So, you will see this on Tuesday. You will see me on Tuesday extra because I'll also be coming at you on Thursday with my regular sale. You will see Michael on Thursday and you'll see Misty and Alex on Thursday. I mean Tuesday, 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 October 20th. Anyhow, we're going to have a great time. You don't want to miss it. And thank you guys all. I hope you made sure to give me a thumbs up on this video. And I hope you're already subscribed to my channel. Because if you're not, you should be. You absolutely should be. And please make sure that you leave me a comment. And share this channel with anyone you think might enjoy it. Because that's important. It, sharing is how I'll get more subscribers. And me getting more subscribers can... Uh, give me better abilities to serve you all better and i am going to say goodbye for now and i hope you all have a great day